Hello everyone, this is Sons Collector with another action figure review, and here I have the Marvel Legends series Ex Eternals uh, figure Kingo. So let's go over the packaging for him real quick. So Marvel Legends logo here, Marvel's Eternals here, Kingo. Here is the side art of Kingo. Uh, Eternals logo here. Here is the back with that same artwork there, a description of Kingo, our Legends logo here. And this way we'll be gil building Gilgamesh. We already went over Icarus. Where we did Makari, we still need to do Sprite, um, Cersei, still need to do Fastos, we're doing Kingo now, and we still need to do Druig. Here's the other side, here is the top with that Eternals logo there, and then here's the bottom with the DCPI. But besides that, let's crack them open. And here is Kingo on the package here, so let's go over the accessories first. So first we got Gilgamesh's arm, which we'll go over once we build them. We also got Gilgamesh's fist here extra fist and then that's all we got for the builder figures and then the extra accessory for kingo himself uh we get a shooting hand here with this cool blast effect on his finger uh, i think we've seen this hand before but they kind of glued like this blast effect here it's pretty soft so i wouldn't recommend uh being too rough with this piece specifically but it's a transparent plastic that is kind of just glued onto his fingers there here but yeah, looks pretty cool. And then you get that transparent orange going on there for the blasts. So that's pretty cool. That's unique for the character. And that's what you had in the comic. I mean, in the uh, in the movie. So, and you get a fist in hand here, which we've seen before. And that's what we got for accessories. Here is Kingo up close. So I think it looks pretty close to what he looks like. I think the eye colors are throwing me off just a little bit. Like he looks like he's kind of nuts. But I think the body, uh, this face sculpt is good. At this, I think the eyes are just throwing me off quite a bit. Um, the hair looks pretty close to what the actor looks like. By the way, that actor is hilarious. I've seen him in Stuber, and he just got jacked for Eternal. So I wish we saw more of him in the movie. But yeah, I'm not gonna say too much because um, yeah. This, Kingo is a great character in the movie, though. You get some nice gray-silver detailing here with some gold detailing in the, like, in the uh, sculpt here with some more gold silver here down the middle through the skirt. And then you get this nice sculpted lines here. You get this really nice metallic purple going on throughout the suit. You get this silver so uh, shoulders. You get some uh, like lighter purple here on this neck. You get some gold around the shoulders too. And then you get the silver on the forearms, gold there too. You get fists here. You get the blast effect fingers going on here. You get finger guns. And you get some more silver here throughout the skirt. Purple basically all, all in the back here. So nothing too crazy going on there. And then we get the legs here, which are pretty generic with some uh, sculpting along the bottom part of the leg here for the shins and the calves here. You get some silver here through and then down through the boots. So yeah, and that's all we got for the looks. So let's go over the articulation. So he has a double ball jointed head. So you can look down just that much, up that much. You look left and right. Some head pivoting there. Shoulders can move out that far. 360 rotation, bicep swivel, double jointed elbows. By the way, pinless. Wrists can hinge down that far, up that far, 360 rotation around there. He has a ball joint at the diaphragm, so he can go for just that much, backwards that much, side to side motion, some twisting. Legs he can kick out just that much because the skirt kind of gets in the way there. Forward, same deal going on, getting in the way there. He's got a thigh cut down there. He's got double jointed knees, also pinless joints. And then ankles can hinge down that much, up that much. Nice ankle pivot. So yeah, that's Kingo for you. I really like this uh, figure quite a bit. I, I would say the eyes are just throwing me off quite a bit. But I really dig this suit. Uh, I really love the character in the movie. He's awesome. He's like the comedic relief, kind of, I feel like. 
but it's still awesome. Like, all the characters are pretty good, actually. I think in the movie, they're all pretty good. Um, but it's not, it's not a movie review, so I'm just gonna, it's, it's about the character or figure itself, so. Um, but yeah, I recommend you get him. He's pretty cool. I know that Eternals is right now, the figures from Marvel Legends are kind of just peg warmers at the moment, so I would say maybe wait until they go on clearance for a little bit, and then didn't get them. I know Black Friday is coming up soon, so definitely get them probably around that time, so... Yeah, I think I think this character is pretty much worth getting, um, as long as they're you know on sale or clearance. But yeah, I think this is a cool figure. But besides that, um, I really like the gun finger effects that they added in there because that's basically his only power. He's got the finger guns going. So yeah, but that's all I got for Kingo. If you guys want to check out my link tree, it has my TikTok, Twitch, Instagram, and Twitter. I do some cosplaying on. Uh, TikTok, I talk a little bit of, um, on Marvel Legends quite a bit, um, uh, and yeah, but besides that, thanks for watching.